Welcome to Depression Clinic. I'm Smai Olawoyi. I promised you in the previous episode that I'll be sharing with you a deep analysis about marital prayer. What is marital prayer? Marital prayer can be defined as a force or influence put against your marriage. Force or influence put against your marriage. Marriage yes, is like a plane that have been programmed to have two pilots. One will be major pilot, while other will be co-pilot. In this episode or in this topic, I will be a little bit spiritual in my analysis because marriage is a center of our life. Is the center that will determine whether you will be elevated or you will be downgraded. Is the center that will determine whether you will enjoy this life or you will endure this life. So today, I will focus on some of the singles that I intend to enter into marriage. Let me tell you something. I know in our society today, there are many brothers that are looking for the right wife. There are many sisters that are looking for the right husband. You know what? Know this. Don't allow anybody to mount prayer on you, on who to marry, or when to marry. Or that they will be giving you date that by this time next year, if you are not married, you are this, you are this. Stop it. Close your eyes. Close your ear. Don't listen to them. Remain focus. Focus on your maker. Let me tell you the mind of your maker. Your maker that proposed the marriage, a proposed marriage to occupy two people, the pilot and the co-pilot. And then let me tell you something. That journey is like a padlock and key. Your makeup made key, you also made padlock. And the woman is like a key. White man is like a padlock. You agree with me that padlock cannot function without the key. Meanwhile, key can also not function without a padlock. Padlock is looking for the key, for the right key. Right key is also looking for the right padlock. Because if lock lose the contact with his right key, it will remain locked forever. And also, if key lose contact, with his right paddle, it will remain useless forever. As you are looking for the right wife, your right wife is also looking for you. And with the same frequency, don't allow people prayer to push you to choose wrong woman. Don't allow prayer from your people to, to push you to choose a wrong husband. Remain focused to your maker. In the next episode, I will go deeper than this to share with you the sign that you will see when you meet your right wife. The sign that you will see when you meet your right husband. I remain your host, smile, or love you, I love you.